So what's better, massage or foam rolling? The answer is massage. Unfortunately, many of us don't have the financial capabilities to get massage every day, or we just don't have the time. So this is when foam rolling takes a very big precedent over massage. It's much more practical and it's much more cost effective. The reason why massage is actually better for you if you can manage it is because you actually have two heads working on one body. There's a person able to feel whereabouts your tightnesses are and you're able to tell them, oh yeah, that hurts, that area is much more sensitive, work on that. And they're able to kind of feel out also where about your body is much more tense and tight. Whereas with the foam roller, it's only you. So there are pros and cons to both. However, using a foam roller is much more effective. You're able to fill in the gaps when you don't have the time, when you don't have the financial capabilities to go to the massage ther therapist every day um, to do it on your own. It's primary prevention in terms of keeping yourself healthy. So foam rolling is very effective when you don't have the time or the capabilities to go to the massage therapist every day. So if you do have the financial capabilities, I would definitely recommend you get, you get massage treatment as much as you can. Realistically, this is not possible. So when you don't have the time to go back and forth to the massage therapist, fill in the gaps with the self-massage foam roller. Mm -hmm.